Good afternoon everyone. Myself, Dr. Anshu Singla, Associate Professor, CSE Department, Chitkara University. Today I am going to talk about machine learning, what, why and where. It is the study of computer algorithms that improve automatically through experience. We can have different types of models where the past experiences are stored and on the basis of which we have the analysis. So it's the ability of the model to adapt to new data they are exposed to. It's the ability to learn from the previous computations to produce reliable results. Importance of machine learning happens in vast areas where we are having the different types of analysis to predict, to qual classify and so on. Why we have the machine learning? It is basically large computations at very low cost. It works on exploring the data and learning from previous experiences to identify patterns, to predict them, to classify and moreover it requires the minimal human intervention. It is a subset of AI, artificial intelligence, which focuses on using statistical techniques to build intelligent computer systems in order to learn various and voluminous databases available to it. It is employed in various fields, medical diagnosis, where we can have the large number of computer assisted systems say CAD, medical diagnosis is done with the help of past experiences, number of reports are gathered and kept together, arranged, organized and then based on those past experiences, past experiences we model. Mo on the basis of the model, now the next patient who is coming can be diagnosed in the time because doctors may take the tedious time and it becomes the very long process. We cannot get the immediate effective uh, diagnosis so that the treatment can be started. So medical diagnosis can be the one of the great application where we can have the machine learning. Image processing is another area where we can have the weather forecasting, then face detection, and then character recognition. Inside the weather forecasting, we can have the capture of images and based on the soil properties and all, we can analyze the images and then we can predict the next type of upcoming solutions. Then prediction is another area where we can have the sales forecast, weather forecast. For example, nowadays we can have who will win the match. So based on the previous experiences, we can predict that who is going to win the match. Classification where we can have the different types of fruits, objects that can be classified in different parts. And then comes the regression where we can have the analysis of market, say for an example, what profit of sale is going to happen in upcoming years. So based on all the past experience, we can predict this. So there are number of models which can be used for machine learning and to give the solutions in the upcoming years. Thank you.